this is Stacia the Cutting Mom and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time viewing, I just want to say welcome. And if you have not subscribed to my video, please go ahead and do so and click that bell so you get notified when I upload a new video. So today I'm doing a video on trimming relaxed hair and I'm going to be giving you guys a relaxer trim update on my hair. So I did a video on some relaxed hair tips on how to grow healthy relaxed hair. And my very first tip was get regular trims. So I'm going to leave a link to that video for you guys right here. So you can take a look at it of all the tips that I would recommend in order to grow your relaxed hair healthy and long. Now the key to retaining length is to prevent breakage or minimize breakage. It's probably impossible to prevent breakage, but minimizing as much breakage as possible is gonna be what's key to retaining hair length. So we all get split ends, all of us, black hair, white hair, Spanish hair, all type of hair. We all get split ends. And you can check your hair, you can just look at it, and you, it's kinda like, um, they call it find and destroy. So some people will actually like go through their hair, find the strand with the split end and clip it. That's time consuming, it's tedious. So what you can do is just look through your hair and if you have a lot of split ends, then you know it's time to go get a trim. Um, another thing you can do is put on a light colored shirt, whether it's a t-shirt or if it's something similar to what I'm wearing, um, I have a light check shirt that I usually um, use to check the length of my hair. So you can put on a light colored shirt and you can check your hair to see if it's thinning. If you can see through your hair, if it's very clear that you can see through it, you know those ends are thinning and you need to trim. What I recommend is to get on a schedule and I would suggest you do the same thing that I do. So I am on a relaxed hair trim schedule. So whenever I relax my hair, I go to the salon. If you trim your hair yourself, more power to you. I cannot do it. I want a good trim. So I go to a salon. That's how I keep my schedule. So I either get trims every three months or every four months. Now, about two years ago, I started noticing the bottom part of my hair um, a lot shorter than the top part of my hair. So if we look here, we see the length there. And if we go underneath, we see it's shorter, right? We see that shorter than the top section of my hair. And the reason for that is because I wore my hair down a lot and the rubbing against the back of my clothes that friction was causing a lot of breakage. So the bottom of my hair was um, was really short and I had a lot of breakage underneath compared to the top. And that caused my hair to look like a lot thinner um, on the back. So if I wore my hair all down, it caused it to look a lot thinner, right? So I went on a journey to Restore that, restore the growth underneath. So what I'm doing is I'm avoiding wearing my hair down a lot. So the only time I really will wear my hair down is on the weekends, guys. And that's if I'm going out. When I'm going to work, I pull my hair in an updo, protective style, and that is so I can protect the back of my hair so that I can avoid the breakage on the back. So this is my light check after my relaxer. And you can see I have some thinning hair. And that's basically because the hair on the bottom is a lot shorter than the hair on top. And this is my length check after my trim. And you can see it's a lot fuller than it was. And she took off about two inches. All right, guys, so there you have it. That is my length check update. And every time I go to the salon now, um, she'll just continue to trim so that the back of my hair catches up 
to the top part of my hair and it stays looking fuller and healthier. Okay guys, so that's it. That's my relaxed hair trim update. The next time I get a relaxer, which will be about four months, um, will probably be about three months because I'm right now I am one month post relaxer. So in the next three months, um, I will be I will be getting another one and I will give you guys an update on that. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it helpful and I hope it encourages you to get your regular trims. Give me that thumbs up if you like it. If you have not subscribed, please go ahead and do so and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.